Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to glow objects neon in Procreate. Okay, so the first step you have to do is pick a bright neon color. So I picked this really, really bright lime green. So that's what we are going to use today. And then make sure you pick a monoline brush and you can either draw an object or you can draw lettering. So I have already drawn this for us so we can see how this works. Now we are going to want to go to our adjustments panel. We're going to find bloom. This effect is how you get that really cool neon look on your entire layer. So we're going to tap layer. Okay, so we want to make sure that the size is around 45. And the burn is around 45 and that your bloom is around 45 as well. Okay. And that's how you're gonna start. Now, with different colors, you're going to want to adjust the bloom and the burn. Um, lighter colors, you're not gonna have to adjust it as much as you would as if you're picking a darker color. So let's go ahead and adjust. Kind of see what we want. Kind of like that one a little bit brighter. Maybe at 50. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay. So that's all we have to do to make something neon. So I have a couple different examples of what you can do. So this one looks awesome. I love it. Let me show you a couple other ones. So I did this hello. And then I also did this really cool coffee mug. I did a little palm tree. And I also have um, a couple different examples right here um, to show you because before we had the bloom tool, we were able to glow things neon with Gaussian Blur. And I know some people still use Gaussian Blur to, to make things really cool and neon, but I don't love it. And so right here, I have an example of where I used Gaussian Blur to do the neon effect and it doesn't really pop as much and then I'll show you I did the exact same word but I used bloom to do the neon effect totally different right so with the new bloom tool that's pretty much all I'm using to get this neon effect and Gaussian blur doesn't really do it for me anymore so it's really up to you as to what you want but I'm Team Bloom and I love it and I'm so excited to show you this feature because it's really fun and cool and you can do a ton of different things with it. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next week.